Space, Part 3, The Gas Giants Next, after Mars, are a lot of smaller things called asteroids. Here's a few. The biggest asteroid is called Ceres, but sometimes it is called a dwarf planet, a small planet. Ceres is much smaller than the Earth and Moon. Here's Ceres. Now we have looked at all the inner planets, called the terrestrial planets. There they are again. The inner planets are closer to the sun. There they are going around the sun. Now we zoom out to the outer planets. The next planets are very big. They are called the outer planets and also the gas giants. Jupiter, Saturn, Uranus, and Neptune. The outer planets are far, far away from the Sun. Again, Pluto is no longer considered a planet. First of the outer planets is Jupiter, which is the biggest planet in the solar system, much, much bigger than the Earth. Wow! Jupiter is covered by thick clouds and is very stormy. It has a famous storm called the Great Red Spot. Jupiter has four big moons that you can see through binoculars. Through binoculars, Jupiter and its four moons look like this. That's neat. The four moons are Io, which has volcanoes, Europa, which has an ocean under its smooth ice, Ganymede, which is the largest moon of Jupiter, and finally, Callisto, which may also have a salty ocean under its dark, icy surface. Maybe Jupiter looks like this from the surface of Io. It's just a, an artist's imagination. Jupiter has many other moons and a thin ring. The next planet is Saturn. Saturn is famous for its beautiful rings. It has only one very big moon called Titan. There it is. It has an atmosphere. Titan is bigger than our moon and bigger also than Mercury and Pluto. Here's Titan right here. Maybe if you looked at Saturn from Titan, it would look like this. Again, that's just a, an artist's imagination at work. Next are two more gas giants, Uranus and Neptune. They aren't as big as Jupiter or Saturn. First is Uranus. Uranus has a ring, too. Uranus is strange because it rotates on its side. See how its ring is sideways. Next comes Neptune, which is a pretty blue, and which has a big moon called Triton. That's an actual picture of Triton. 
Those are all the gas giants, Jupiter, Saturn, Uranus, and Neptune. Beyond Neptune are many smaller objects called trans-Neptunian objects. Here are the largest known trans-Neptunian objects. Notice Pluto is there. It's one of them. Pluto is the most famous. It is called a dwarf planet, and it has a moon called Charon. That's how that's pronounced. The trans-Neptunian objects are in a huge place far, far away, circling the sun, called the Kuiper Belt. That's just a, an imaginary notion of what the Kuiper Belt is. It doesn't look like that. That is our solar system. The end.